Hello, welcome to Weekly Budgie, where we make tips and tutorials on how to take care of your budgie. And today, we'll be teaching you on how to tame your budgie. If you barely got your budgie, you should give it one to three days so it will be able to know its area. When you think your budgie is ready, just start off by having your hand right next to them. This will teach them that your hand is not a danger, but just don't make any sudden movements because that will scare them. You should do this one for at least a week. Next, just try to have some food in your hand. I prefer to do spray millet because it's kind of hard for birds to refuse those kind of treats. Eventually through time, your budgie will be able to get used to you and start jumping on your hand, kind of like the way you see Sky is doing. I mean a budgie requires patience, and if you're trying to rush through this, it will end up being bad because your budgie will end up losing your trust. What I did next, instead of giving them a small amount of spray millet, I just broke the spray millet in half and grabbed on my hand and tried to make them perch on my hand. Doing this will allow your budgie to learn to perch on your finger. Sky really surprised me because on her first week with me, she already learned how to perch on my finger because she saw Tweety perching on my finger and saw that it was safe. As you can see, Rio's learning to eat off my hand because he saw that it was safe for Sky to do it. As you can see, Rio is not jumping on my hand. That's because he's still on the hand feeding procedure. Budgies work on their own level, so that's why taming requires patience. And doing this procedure is about a month. After some time, just have your finger in front of your budgie and see if it'll try to perch on your finger. Also, don't forget to give your budgie a treat when it does this, so that way it knows what it did was good. This should last till your budgie is comfortable with your finger. I know a lot of budgie owners like to have their budgie perched on their finger and then just slowly take them out of their cage, but I like to do something different. I remove all food containers and just leave them in front of the cage. I also leave the cage open so that way my budgies will be able to come out of the cage whenever they want to. Doing this will allow your budgie to be more comfortable being outside of its cage. And if you keep doing this, your budgie will eventually learn that being outside of its cage, it's safe. And also make sure your place is bird proof, so that way your budgie won't get injured just in case it gets frightened. That's all for today's video. Don't forget to subscribe and like to the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.